Hey there, uh, today you're gonna be making your very own marble maze. What you will need is a couple containers of Play-Doh. You will need, of course, a marble, and you will need a dry erase board. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your Play-Doh and you're gonna roll it into very thin snakes or worms, whatever you wanna call it. And then you are going to create a very simple design on your dry erase board. Uh, you wanna make sure that a marble will be able to travel down um, when your board is at a slope. Um, and you wanna be careful not to combine any of the colors so that it's easy to clean up at the end. And then um, just make sure that there is an entrance and an exit on your board. And uh, after you've done that and you've patted down your Play-Doh so that it stays in place and doesn't slide around, you are going to set up your experiment. So you are gonna do this by having your dry erase board tilted just ever so slightly, just a little bit off the ground. So on one side, it's off the ground just a little bit, and then the other side, it's touching. So you are going to take your marble and you're gonna start it up at the top, and you are going to let it roll down. Okay, and then you're gonna do the same thing, but you are gonna increase the incline or the angle at which the uh, maze is, and you're gonna do the same thing. Okay. And then you're gonna increase it again and again and again. And you're going to kind of make some observations about what the marble is doing. So that's the first experiment that you're gonna be doing is changing the incline. And then the second experiment that you're gonna be doing is changing the landing surface of the maze. So first I'm going to see what it does when it rolls onto the carpet. So I'm going to start my marble up at the top, just let go and watch it roll. Okay, and then I'm gonna do the same thing, but I'm gonna do it over here on the concrete. And then we're gonna see how the marble rolls differently. So I'm over here, about the exact same incline. I'm just gonna hold my marble. Okay, so after you guys have done those two experiments, I want you and your group members to discuss um, how the speed of the marble changed when you changed the incline of the maze, and then how the distance the marble traveled changed when you changed the landing surface from carpet to concrete. So those are your discussion questions. Um, if you have any questions, I would either rewatch the video or ask your teacher. And I hope you guys have a really fun time creating your marble bases. Bye!